Today in this comprehensive guide, we will know how to install macOS Monterey in Windows PC. But before starting installation, make sure to watch this video two to three times because it's important to follow all the steps as it is. So without getting further delay, let's get started. So first of all, just you'll have to download the things. To download, just open the browser and in the browser, just search for Olarilla and open the Olarilla website. In this website, just go to Vanilla Images and scroll a little bit here you will find Monterey Olarilla just click here and download will be started and then just click on the EFI folders just here scroll a little bit and here you will find the EFI folders you will have to download from here as per your system specifications and then just you will have to download Belena Eacher and file explorer plus plus and mini tool partition wizard this three application downloading link will be given in the description after downloading just extract the zip files one by one now both the two files are extracted now you can delete the zip files now just double tap on the villain each tool and install it and also install the mini partition tool click on yes accept terms and conditions and click next and next and the installation will be started Okay, just finish it. Now open just Belena Eacher and here you'll have to insert a pen drive minimum 16 GB. In my case, my pen drive is inserted here. And now just click on the flash from file and just go to download folder and select the Monterey file and click on open. Okay, now just click on flash and it will erase everything on your pen drive. You'll have to wait here to complete the process. When the pen drive is ready, it will show flash completed. Just close this application now after creating the bootable pen drive just open browser and search for proper tree github and here you will find the very first link proper tree github just open the link and from here just scroll a little bit just to click here and here you will get the proper tree file just close the browser and open the file explorer go to download folder in the download folder just extract the proper tree it is extracted just open the proper tree folder again open the folder and just here you will find proper tree just double tap on it and click on more info just click on run anyway now just type y and hit enter it will take some time please wait now it will download the python you will have to wait here okay after downloading the python the utility is opened automatically now just click on file click on open go to the download folder and here you will find your efi just open the efi go to efi go to oc and select the config.plist and click on open okay, it is opened just make it full screen now on your keyboard press ctrl plus f and search for nvram here you will find the nvram tab just scroll a little bit and here you will find boot ergs just double tap here and give a space just add this command line and go to file click on save and now close this application click on yes now again go to the download folder and open the file explorer plus plus run as administrator click on yes minimize this and open the menu tool partition click on yes launch the application and select the efi folder of the pen drive right click on it and click change format right click on the efi folder and click on change later click on ok click on apply click on yes now click on ok it is done now again go to file explorer plus plus now this time just go to the download folder and open the efi folder select them and right click on them just click on copy and go to this pc open the efi folder and just paste them here click on replace the file destination okay now it is done now just close the explorer file and also close the file manager close application and now just right click on the start menu and select disk management from here just create a minimum 100 gb disk space to install mac os just right click on a bigger drive click on shrink volume after choosing your space just click on shrink now just right click on the unallocated space click on new simple volume click on next click on next click on next put the name of the drive as mac os and click on next click on finish okay it is done now just restart your pc and access the bias menu to access the bios menu of your pc just refer this photo otherwise you can search on google now on the bios menu you have to set up your bios as follows after doing the specified changes just press f10 on your keyboard and 
hit enter now this time you have to access the boot menu of your pc to access the boot menu you can refer this photo otherwise you can search on google on the boot menu just select your pen drive and hit enter on the screen just select install mac os monterey and hit enter just wait a few seconds now just on the screen select your language and click on this arrow button now just select disk utility and click on continue now on the screen now from the drop down select show all devices here you will find the mac os drive which you have created just select this drive and click on erase from the drop down select apfs and click on erase now it is done just click on done close the utility and select install mac os monterey just click on continue now click on continue click on agree again click on agree and now this time just select your drive which you have created earlier and click on continue here it will take some time to install the mac os on your pc you will have to wait here until the installation process is completed whenever your pc restarts you will have to access the boot menu of your pc and select the pen drive and hit enter and now this time you will see mac os installer option just select the mac os installer and hit enter now this time apple logo will appear and you will have to wait 20 to 30 minutes here now whenever your pc restarts again just access the boot menu and select the pen drive and hit enter here again select the mac os installer and hit enter again access the boot menu of your pc and just select your pen drive and hit enter now this time you will find mac os select the mac os and hit enter now again access the boot menu of your pc and select the pen drive and hit enter now again select mac os and hit enter now here just select your country and click on continue select your preferred language and click on continue select not now click on continue select not now select setup letter select skip click on agree again click on agree now here just put your full name and the account name will be automatically populated now here set your password just re-enter your password just confirm your password here and here you can give the password hint and here you can choose your profile picture after setting everything just click on continue now just here enable the location and click on continue just uncheck this and click on continue now click setup letter select your theme and click on continue you have installed mac os monterey on your system just click on quit now just open the install mac os monterey logo and go to files just open the open core configurator app click on tools click on mount efi and here you will find apfs here it is the pen drive efi just click on mount and put the password of your mac os and hit enter okay here the efi is mounted open the efi keep the efi as here and now again go to the partition and click on mount partition okay select open partition okay efi is opened here now just open the efi folder and also open the efi folder here just select these two right click on them select copy just go to this file right click on here and paste two items just click on replace okay done now just close everything and just restart your pc to windows now just click on start search for cmd and select run as administrator click on yes now just type this command and hit enter now just close the command and restart your pc this time your pc will show the dual boot option now you can see that the dual boot option is visible automatically